Hello everybody, this is Havoc. Welcome to the next episode of Project High Rise. This is the uh, Tower Sim Builder. Sim Tower Builder? Anyways, we're building the tower. <laughs> uh, if you missed the first episode, it kind of just went in overview. We did a new game just to see what it was like. Um, I failed epically, so I'm hoping that uh, this time around I won't be able to fail as badly. Today we are starting the new scenarios. There is a list of scenarios which of course will probably increase or decrease <coughs> uh, once it's finally released. This is a test build so everything in this may not be in the final build or everything might be in plus some. Uh, one thing I wanted to mention while I was looking through stuff, I, I did notice there is a mods tab here, and I think that's really cool. Uh, you know, they already have it built in, they're already planning on having um, a mod in here, and I think that's really good because, uh, especially for any kind of city simulation kind of game, mods really keep the game alive. There's things that people do that I'm just like, oh, I had never thought of that. You know, there might be new restaurants, there may be, you know, I don't even know what they would build. You know, you could have new restaurants, new different kinds of offices. You could build, like, city halls. I mean, there's just so much things that you could do. So the fact that they already have this built in is pretty cool. Obviously, there's nothing there because the game hasn't been released yet. But we're going to start with a new scenario. Neighborhood Revitalization. The area of town has seen better days. And those in power have their way. It will see those days better days again soon. The building was once a jewel in the city's architectural pantheon. Ooh, fancy wording. <clears throat> Its lobby retains a vestige of those bygone glories with a stunning lobby mural protected by the city's landmark commission. Your task is to revive this building to its former splendor. The land excuse me, wow, that was gross. The landmark commission will be arranged for subsidies for floor and infrastructure. Construction and we are looting. Awesome. Okay. So the goals for this this um scenario. We have to restore the building to solid financial health with a daily revenue of $25,000, dear lord almighty. <clears throat> we need to achieve the city's goal of revitalizing this neighborhood by having a building population of at least 250. Oh, dear lord almighty. And then new landmarks, add your own construction to the building's already significant artistic trust with a new fountain, either inside or outside. That's not too bad, but the other two, I'm like, holy crap, they are just, they're aggressive, aren't they? That won't be, I think we'll be able to manage it. So let's take a look at our building. As you can see, it's dirty, it's mangy. We are losing quite a bit of money a day. Uh, it's disorganized as all get out. These guys probably don't make a whole lot. Rent is too high, didn't turn a profit. There's too few customers or too much competition. I'm gonna say too much competition. Let's take a look at the traffic. Let's see where everyone goes. There's a lot of people that just go to these two building areas I almost want to start and take out this elevator that would drive traffic more it would open up a little bit of space I don't know what it open up space for hmm interesting interesting yeah there's way too many but we have we have more shops right I guess we could see Rent is too high, but they like being in a high traffic area. We're not going to change the rent for now, guys. So if you're unhappy, you're just going to have to move out. I got plenty of tenants in line who are willing to, to do the dirty work and get that done. Okay, so these guys... Um... I mean, they're all making money. This dude's not. So I think I may delete him... Rent is too high. This unit is getting worn down. So what we need to do is this... That's a copy center. <clears throat> we got a copy center, office supplies, construction office, and maintenance office. So we could start right off... I thought we had $20,000. Well, that's rude. Um, we could drop the ball and just do a crap ton of these. I think that would probably help a little bit. Um, we can get a medium, oh wow, medium office is huge. Can we, I don't want to waste space. So let's go ahead and build some offices down here. Um, what else can I build? Yeah, I'm not even, I'm not even going to build apartments right now. That's not smart. Uh, can we build a door as well? That's one thing I wanted to figure out because, <coughs> oh, excuse me. 
Because there's not a door over here. And I want a door. Hmm. Okay, so maintenance-wise, we should probably queue some stuff up, though. That's a storeroom. Lots of storage. Courier. And the storeroom. We got, what, maintenance is... Nope, maintenance isn't right there. That's maintenance. Okay. So we need to renovate 11 offices. And... Renovate two restaurants. Um, three total tenants. There we go. We'll just do that. Okay. So that only dropped us. Okay, I see that. I see what's going on now. So for now, let's go ahead and just hit play. Uh, people are decently satisfied. There is grime everywhere, but that's what the maintenance department will do. They'll clean that area up, and we'll get rolling. A small store. Oh, that's nice. We already have a small store. That's what that is. They're not making a lot of revenue. So let's go ahead and get creative offices. What do we have? I'm going to slow it down. We have foam. Or we have electrical all throughout the building. What's our capacity? Um... Utilization 52%. There is phone everywhere. Phone is utilization at 70%. We don't have cable, water, or gas, which we don't really need right now, but we'll put that in in a little bit. Um, so we have everything we need so we could put a creative office in here because we have an office supplies and we have a courier service, which is pretty much the standard that we need for all of those guys. Let's see who gets the most rent. It's going to be these guys, some lawyers. And then I'm also going to do some contracts. Remind the public. Uh, what is this? Generate more daily visitors and generate some buzz. Basic offices. Um, a diverse group of 16 offices. All right, so we need two more insurance agents. Yep, we're going to take that hit. Uh, let's go ahead and go super fast forward time. Get the maintenance workers working. There they go. They're working. I just don't want to have an empty... I don't want to have a one space right there. I don't like that. Call me OCD. Call me whatever you want. It just it doesn't work. Not for me. Look, they're cleaning that up all real nice now. Let's get another insurance office in here. Pays 95. That'll work. Uh, yeah, we're losing. Oh, hey, look at that. We're already turning a profit. I'm going to go ahead and bring in another insurance. And then we'll get some lawyers in here. There we go. We're about to have the basic office contract filled up. Oh, look at that. That's real nice. Ooh, a medium restaurant or a diner. Now, why can't I do it in here? Is it because it's decorated? Because I can take it off. I can take it off, and... I can put a restaurant. Why can't I put a restaurant? Space is already occupied by what? Oh, scones. Skins. Uh, so we already have stuff over here, so why not just build um, we could just go ahead and build all the way over there but I think I'm gonna build all the way over here look at all those people we're just gonna build all the way up something has displeased one of your tenants who is displeased and why we did not turn a profit yesterday that's not my fault rent is too high that's not my I'll drop it Oh, that's oh, that's forty something bucks. We're gonna lose a day. That's dumb, but it'll be all right. We'll do that, uh, and we'll put in phone because restaurants won't take up this entire thing. But a medium diner or a restaurant won't be too bad of a deal. People are already moving along. What about maintenance? What are you What are you guys doing? 
They're getting there. Okay, they're 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 cleaning the place up. They're spicing it up. We're already at three prestige, everyone. So we're we're moving along quite well. Okay, so that's out. I want to build a nice restaurant, but not a pizza place, not a diner, not a. Oh, we could do a diner. Salad and hot bars. They get 300. Let's see what all these places give me first. Oh, yeah, we're making a thousand already. Look at that 250, 290, 300. We're gonna go with Lakeview Diner. They need. Ooh, they need water. Okay. That's different. We're already starting to get into the water. Um, I need to figure out where I'm gonna put that. Ooh. Uh, let's do that, but let's pause it real quick, because I have to figure out where I'm going to put water. I mean, I could always just draw... I don't want... The thing is, you're going to have to have it go straight up, so it's going to have to be in a place... Ugh, I shouldn't have built that right there. Oh, that's a lot of money. I just really, really kind of screwed up. Unless I can build... Are those the same space? They're not. And that's too far. I can build two offices here, though, at once. And then two more offices. Okay, so that's what we'll do. It's not the best idea. And that also requires us to extend this out. Uh, so let's go ahead and do that real quick. Let's have them build. And then once they get here, once they get to this point, I'm going to drop that water heater tank down in the bottom and we'll be right as rain an interior decorator she can go in the bottom I don't care I know you don't have water I'm working on it here we go uh, water let's go ahead and build you a 51 that's a big old barrel water Oh, I need a, a water closet. There we go. We'll get it, ladies and gentlemen. We'll get it. Do I have to have one on each floor? I think I do. Okay, you should be good then. Oh, there we go. Look at that. People already coming in. Super awesome. I love it. Um, I don't know what this big space can be used for. I may just have to suck it up and put offices in there. I didn't want to. Didn't want to at all. But look at these guys. Look at them. They are making money like crazy. Um, I'm just going to chill. I'm going to relax for a moment. Here's what we can do. We can put the interior decorator. I'm just going to have to suck it up and put things in here that just aesthetics. Right? Oh, we need to do this again. Plan for 12 medium offices. Wow! And then studio apartments and remind the public. Let's go ahead and sign that contract. We have a buzz of 100. Oh, we need to have a buzz of 100. Have 25 visitors in your building at one time. Okay, sweet. Um, aesthetics. Aesthetics. Uh, Ada Systems, I don't need your help, I'm sorry. Not at the moment, anyways. Don't worry. It's nothing personal. It's not you, it's me. Okay, so we need to generate more buzz. Nope, that's not it. There we go. We'll just do everything on this level like that. Sweet. I don't know what I want to build down here. But I could build a couple more offices. All right, so our we went down quite a bit. Electric and phone, that's what they both have. Let's do legal offices, maybe? Oh, no, we're going to do these guys. And then 110, 110. Send out an ad for the creatives and see what, what comes up. Give it a minute. Minute five less. <clears throat> Holy cow, there we go. Sweet. 
I don't know what I want to put down here yet. There's a lot of stuff that we can do. Um, and we might just put some, a medium office in here or something, you know? I don't know. I don't know, I don't know, I don't know. But having these offices go right by this dude is a pretty good idea. And we may just sit for a day and see what everything gets counted for. Uh, the courier services, or copy center. <coughs> <coughs> You can't let media buzz to start a new media campaign. Where's the media campaign at? I have no idea where that is. It's probably click on her. No, that's the interior decorator. I should have actually like looked at her. Politics. We could have a political office in here. Oh no, no, I don't want that. Oh, I'm kidding. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. Yes. Oh. I don't want that. <laughs> Not yet. Office for your building manager? What does he need an office for? Above ground, on the ground floor. That's kind of dumb. Alright, let's see what we're making. When this next turn is over with it, all automatically your day, your budget, whatever, spawns at like midnight. So, we'll be all good there. We'll see what midnight comes. Making 898 a day. So, we're going to take a hit for a day. Uh, because I'm going to fill up this side of the building. We're going to draw electrical wire. And phone wire. Which also means we're probably going to have to drop... Uh, some more boards as well as a new electrical outlet and no nope, there wouldn't be enough space when I gotta remember to add my waters up there and we're just gonna drop offices out the wazoo creatives they make a lot of money this will be like the creative area. Yeah, let's go ahead and run another ad for creative offices. <clears throat> and plus, that'll give these guys some extra money. Because they'll be walking through to get to them. See, look at that. Already making money. Did these guys make money yesterday? Look at that. They're making a ton of money. Oh, yeah. Could not dispose of our trash. Oh. I didn't think about trash. Since they're a fancy diner and all. Creative offices. Man, these guys are just... They really pay the money, don't they? We'll go ahead and just drop legal offices there. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Remind the public. Have 25 if your visitors are blah blah blah. Alright. Yeah, we're gonna get hit just a little bit on this turn. And I need to make, apparently. Let's go ahead and just make trash. A trash bin level, that's what I'll call it. Once they get done. So, yeah, we're gonna take a big hit. I guarantee that plummets. For the moment, and we're gonna have to add new motherboards, or not motherboards, new circuit, whatever things for phone. Oh, look at that, 1800 a day, that works. A new phone board. Utilization 23%. I'll take it. That's worth the hit. Let's run some more creative ads. drop those offices there. Seriously, these guys are just going to like pay the bills for me. I wonder if there's a disadvantage to having a lot of creative offices. I 
happens. Right now, I don't see it. Uh, remind the public. Okay, so what's going on here? Uh, bu bu bum. 25 visitors in your building at one time. We have 25. I don't know what's, why, why it's saying we don't have 25 visitors. I guess we don't have 25 visitors. Uh, so let's go ahead and work on garbage just real quick. I gotta figure out where it is real quick. Uh, it's gonna be here. Uh -huh. Trash. This requires a trash bin on their floor. We're just gonna, like I said, that's what this whole designated area is. And then we need um, a trash bin collector, which is right there. Oh, look at that. Sweet. We made some dough. And we can now get small two-bedroom apartments. That's very nice. Uh, what is this? Hmm. This building has what people in the biz call good bones. Using existing base for a tall tower. And get more restaurants and retail moved in. What does that mean? Have a building that is 15 floors above street level. Oh, wow. Uh, medium stores and medium restaurants. Okay. Okay, we can do that. We can certainly do that. Oh, I wish... Oh, of course. What if I delete that? Delete it, and I'm going to put medium offices in there. Because I don't think these guys are going to need trash. I just put trash there because there's also other restaurants here. There we go. What do you what do you what do you need? You know what? Forget it. These guys will move in right away. Expects janitorial and commercial printing services. Oh, there's the kicker. There's the kicker. Alright, so we're making fifteen hundred a day, which isn't too bad. I'm not really sure how we're gonna make so many, but we'll get it figured out. Cause we gotta make what? We gotta make twenty-five thousand. Twenty-five thousand a day, I think, is our twenty-five thousand or more. Oh, okay. Well, daily revenue. Okay, I thought it. I mean, we had to. We had to net more. Okay. We still have to get two hundred and fifty residents, though. That's a. That's quite an achievement. But we can get a medium store now. Oh snap, things are looking up. Um, we could get office there. I don't really know that I want to. What about a bottled water service? Oh, it fits perfectly. Janitorial service. Let's go ahead and do that. Why are these in disrepair? just gonna have to do this every time oh this guy needs water which looky there we have there we go now you can't complain sweet we are moving up in the world we can have a large two-bedroom apartment Dang. Uh, I say we could probably hmm Maybe build a couple of floors here that are currently empty and then build like two or three floors of apartments. I think that might be a good idea. We could test that theory out. I don't know. That's a lot of... That's a lot. Um, and we could go here. I just don't want to build too much. I, I don't want to build too much too fast. And I'm afraid that might be too fast. Uh, we could go with those. Oh, nope. There we go. Super bland. I love it. Look at that mural. That's cute. Alright, so let's see how much we make n today. And we'll really see whether or not we could do anything fun. But look at that. We have so many offices. We need medium stores and medium restaurants. How big is a medium store? Okay. How big? Oh, we already have a medium restaurant, so I know how big that is. Uh, total revenue is 5900 That's not bad. 
yeah, I mean, there's we still have a ways to go. So let's go ahead and drop some money. And build some flows. Um, and then, obviously, go up there. You know what, we may only have... Mm, I don't know. I don't know, man. We'll go ahead and drop some major dough here. So this is going to be a big renovation, which hopefully doesn't screw me over in the in the long run. We'll see. I built a lot, so we're probably going to take a pretty big hit. There we go. My, uh, my light fell. That was fun. Look at all those people. Guys, I will be right back. I'm just going to let this run, so you guys just enjoy it. It will literally just be like a couple of minutes. So, I mean, there's not much I'm going to do anyways. I'm just going to let this sit. And uh, look at all that buzz we're generating, man. We got a lot. I got to figure out how to do a media campaign as well. Look at this, and I'm already back. No problemo. That's a lot of stuff we're doing up there. Okay, how do we do a media campaign? Oh, we just click on it. Well, that was easy. Call in a favor. Apartment construct. Oh, there we go. We're going to keep that. Increase satisfaction. Offices, happy drones. Um, retail and restaurant construction. We're going to do this when we do the apartment, when we build our apartments, which won't happen until the next episode, by the way. But uh, that's all right. So we got everyone's decently, I say decently satisfied. Oh, they need bottled water. You didn't tell me you needed bottled water. Why you do these? Why you do these? Um, interior decorator. I'm sorry. I'm going to have to let you go. It's not you. It's uh it's me. Oh goodness. Oh goodness. I just did that, didn't I? Hold on. Hold on. I just cut off service to like the entire There we go. Okay, good. So we are actually going to go What was I going to do? Bottled water services. Haha. -ha. And they're going to slowly work on these upper four floors. So these two floors are going to be designated restaurants. Uh, yeah, that's what they'll do. That's what they'll be. And then those two floors above them will be nothing but apartments. Or restaurants and stores, I should say. So we may mix and match on this bottom level. And uh, if it comes too much to it, we'll delete these old-timey restaurants. They didn't turn a profit yesterday. That is unacceptable. But yeah, if it comes down to it, we'll definitely get that going. Uh, profitability, aesthetics, satisfaction, that's what... So what's wrong with them? They're going up. So wheat, rent is too high. I don't care about rent. You can, you can deal with it. All of our guys are there. Construction grid. This guy, I mean, this is a really fun game. I like it a lot. Um, save the current game. We'll do that in just a minute. Look at all the people. We got a lot of people coming in, too. And I guess we're still making a profit. I'm surprised. I am really honestly surprised that we're making such a profit. Everyone seems to be doing pretty good. These guys are just going to work on it. I mean, we can build pretty high up. We need at least 15 floors. How much is the renter rounded? That's going to be 70, Buzz. Let's... Um... I wonder if these are permanent. Oh, the effects of a media campaign last 24 hours. Okay. Well, I'm glad I looked at that. So that way, in our 24-hour period, we'll save up some money. And uh, we'll save up money, 
and in a 24 hour period we'll build a whole lot of apartments which hopefully won't I guess it doesn't cost anything to actually build them no it won't cost but look at that those are huge small two bedroom apartments we could fit one in these but that okay so we got two bedroom here I'm gonna try to plan this out just real super quick um, and then a one bedroom apartment we could build what a small we could build three smalls in here and then I could build a one bedroom one, oh come on man one bedroom one bedroom almost one bedroom or one bedroom one bedroom and then small and garbage maybe We'll do something like that. All right, guys. Well, that will be the end of this episode, so I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, give it a thumbs up. If you haven't already, hit that subscribe button. Follow me on Twitch, Twitter, and Facebook. This is the second episode of the Havoc Plays Project High Rise. Again, this will be out in the middle of the summer of 2016. That's the only date I was given and the only date we have to work with. Um, but other than that, this is Havoc, and I am out of here. Peace.